and uh, this is a very young patient a donor is about 23 years of age and uh, so uh, that's the advantage of uh, taking young donors so that you can get a very very good uh, graph so basically uh, we have taken this graft here and made the bubble now i'm just going all around it and dissecting it Doctor Amar, why you chose choose this dissect procedure in this case? Why did I choose what? What did you say? Why did you choose what? This surgery, this again, this case about why the not other PK, about the patient about the you patient. The patient. Indications. Ah. Indications. Pseudo fake bullous keratopathy. This patient is a case of pseudo fake bullous keratopathy. Uh, Sixty-five year old male with the pseudo fake bullous keratopathy. Yep. Uh, now you see, I'm going to just stain it, okay? Now this PDEC graft, all of you, Kashyap, and uh, yeah. uh, Vinod and Satanchu, all of you there could look. It has got endothelium, it has got desmase, and it has the duas layer, which is the pre-desmase layer. I'm keeping it here for about a minute so that the trypan blue stains it properly. Okay. The reason why we are doing exactly. contact is very simple. In DSEC, we are taking 100 micron. This is just 25 micron. The advantage difference between this and DMEC is in DMEC, you're taking a 50 year donors. Here I can play with young donors, which is not possible in DMEX that much because you cannot strip the endothelium and desmase from the uh, duas layer there. Now, wh what is the time? time? 40 seconds, just 10 more seconds more. And then I will take out this graph from the uh, trip on blue. So this basically has got three layers, endothelium, Desmase, yes. which is 15 micron, and a pre desmase layer or a duas layer, which is 10 micron. So, total makes it about 25 micron. Dr. Amar, why you have stained it? I am staining it so that you can see better. Okay. Put empty here. And you put it there for 90 seconds or 60 seconds? I kept it for 60 seconds. Okay. Now, you see the graft is here. Okay. Now, once it is there, I am now going to. Put it on top. MK. Now I'm just putting the graft here. Air. Using an ICL injector, and uh, you can see it going inside. Got it. Now you see, I'm just using the injector here. You can see the way it is folded. Okay. It is very, very MK, important. fast. MK, Shashi, close it. Close. Be careful. It's not Check, Pratap. Now I'm just going to load it in the injector. Be careful, huh? it doesn't come out, Shashi. So once I have done that, is it loaded? Be careful the tip. So, so, so. Please also explain which is the uh, the inner side, which is the outer side. Just which is the inner side and outer side when it is going inside it's better to now explain to you just, how just, it should just, be just, folded just, and how it should come out leave it shashi see this is the injector graft okay now you can see this just hold it there i'm just what going injector? to 
This is a normal upper stomach. I don't know what injector is this. No, no, this is an ICL injector. Yeah. Pause it, Kuruma. I am just going to take this plunger so that it's right into the system there. Okay. And you can see the graph there. Can you see that? All of yeah. you? Yeah. Yes, yes, clear. Yes. Very clear. Okay. Now, once this is there, I'm keeping it away. Now I shift to the patient. So basically, it's an ICL injector. Little different no, no, from. This, you can use any injector, but this was an upper some injector, I think. Okay. Okay, I don't know what injector Zeiss, they gave me. Zeiss injector. Okay, Zeiss injector it was, sorry. Now you see, I fixed a trocar AC maintainer, if you notice here. You yes. See there? This trocar AC maintainer goes from the sclera half millimeter. Now I'm going to take off this air. Salen, air off. I've also done, if you notice, single pass fourth row pupillosity because of iris was damaged. So it's AC maintainer with trocar, which helps it snug fitting. Normally yeah, we put- it's Correct, correct. Absolutely correct. Normal AC maintainer can be leaky, but this is a very snug fit. Salain. There's no leak from uh, AC maintainer side. Salain, Shashi passed. Wait, just wait. wait. There's an opening here. Salain, could? Okay. Stop. Now see the graft is gone inside. Okay. We are injecting at this which level? Which level means it's in the anterior chamber. Anterior this, chamber. This is the anterior chamber. Yeah. So I just want to suture this wound. Yeah. It will be unfold later on. So yeah. It doesn't yeah. come out, and then only we will be uh, rolling the graft so that it is get stuck to the body. Amar sir, this this case you are already finished. Uh, people are plus Wait. One. And the dissection also. I just want to close this wound so that the graph sometimes can pop out. Amar sir. Time. Dr. Amar, you have done uh, pupiloplasty uh, before only. Endothelium, you are... Hello? Okay, now once I've got the suture in place, now my next step is I need to... This bleed is because of the previous trauma of the surgery, which the surgeon had done and has damaged the iris a bit. Okay, now my next step is I want to make it a bit shallow the AC. I will just flatten the AC a bit. Now you see we are trying to unroll the graft. See, the graft is getting unrolled. Can you see that? It is opening. It is opening. Yeah. How to make out it is on the I'll exact position? Don't, one minute. How to make it's not upside down? Simsky fast. Keep it less. Now you see, I've just centered it. Okay. Can you see that? Yes, yes. Yeah. See the ease with which we are able to handle the graph. This is the advantage of the Dua's layer and young donors. So how do you make it upside down or I'm coming to it? I'm coming to that. Just a second. Now you see this is unrolled here. You see now the graft is centered and unrolled. Okay. Now the right. question is very simple. How did I know which is where it is? So that case is over. Now I'll talk to you people. Okay, can you have my camera on? Yeah, oh, you excellent surgery, Amar sir. Are uh, you able to see me? Yeah, yeah. able yeah, to see you, sir. Very well. So now what did I do basically is, you see, we took the graft, 
I injected it inside. Now see the graft should be like this. Okay, if you see the paper like this, the graft is like this. Right. Okay, this is the way it should be. That means on top I'm having the cornea. Here below is iris. Okay. If it is like this, it's upside down. You get my point? It has to be cool. Now, yeah, how do you know this is right? If you don't, I'm not marked. Okay. Right, right. Okay. What I did was simple. I used an endo eliminator from outside. This trick was taught to me by Susan. So, with the endo eliminator from outside, I know exactly whether the graft is this way or this way. Brilliant. When I saw it was this way, all we did was we unrolled it. The advantage in PDEC is understand me, how much time did we take in the surgery? If you notice, not much because the duas layer splints the graft. So you have endothelium deathways and then the duas. So first advantage is I'm able to play with young donors. That's the first step. Right, the right. Step is, the second step is I'm also not only able to play with young donors because of the splinting of the duas to the endothelium and desmes, you'll notice I could just manipulate the graft. The graft was slightly on one side. All I did was move it to the center it becomes center is slightly the edges are unrolled i just had to tap like this to unroll it i injected it air it stuck to the center when my procar acm has got air continuous infusion on air is continuously inside the eye and the graft gets attached fully any doubts now thank you it was amazing our sir uh, this is gaurav here i'm actually in my ot i'm not in the audience right now because we are operating Hi, in my hospital I want thank to you say so much it was astounding all of you vinod satan you gaurav all of you so we are so grateful for you to accept to operate for us actually and uh, you know the audience was really wanted to operate to operate yes so, uh, so thank you Omar. Now, can you just shift one second and then we'll shift to ashwin surgery just can you put the signal of the surgery please for a second yeah if you see the gra the graph now see the blue color you no. are asking me why I stained it. It is fully blue in color, if you notice. So it's very clearly seen. Yeah, yeah. That okay. that we can make out now why we have stained it. Because just like the capsule in the hepatitis catheter staining is always good. So we can see, visualize it good. So thank you, Amar. And thank, thank you, you very you much, take everybody. And we are shifting now to.